Hello, this is Angelis. Thank you for coming, Angelis Stationery Room. Today, I want to talk about fountain pen. Let's enjoy with me. This fountain pen is a very cheap, inexpensive pen. This is three dollars. This is like ten dollars. Um. These two are amazing. I will highly recommend to beginner or fountain pen starter. Yeah, I bought for the greater. I don't want to <laughs> fill another fountain pen I have. Yeah, because fountain pen is fountain pen queen is like a pain in the butt. <laughs> Greater, shiny stuff, sparkle stuff. It's very, very hard to clean. So I decide to using these inexpensive pen. So something wrong, but I can toss away. No guilty, right? Yeah. I thought this is three dollars. So. Maybe I can have fun with it, but I washed it, but I can't wash completely. Um, can you see? It's still greater. Stick. It can't come out. Um, can you see? inside I try take off this is easy to take out nib but this feed can't come out so it can't wash here probably I'm gonna toss away this three dollars so if you use in the grater, I recommend this Kakuno because um, this is I not washing yet. So you can see it's grater on everywhere. Dirty. Kakuno is amazing. Like, let's see, this is Kakuno converter. Yeah. Kakuno converter. And yeah. here is the pen. You can take off and feed and the nib here is completely out so it just Can you see the greeter? Oh, greeter! It's so shiny. <laughs> so it's ten dollars, but it's completely take off everything. It's like a five different parts: cap, um, body, um, nib, cap, body, nib, and feed, um. What's the call? Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Go inside. <laughs> um, heads. I don't know what 
what's called the parts but completely five different parts separating so easy to clean the shiny stuff the if still feed is not enough clean i can brush and clean but preppy it can't take out here so this is three dollars but i can't wash completely so i can't use anymore but kakuno ten dollars but still you can reuse it after i wash it so if you try looking for the very cheap pen for the glitter or something shiny stuff or yeah i highly recommend uh, kakuno because very easy to clean also uh, i do highly highly recommend to fountain pen beginner because same reason it's very easy to take care well if you're not using the shiny stuff the ink preppy is really really good i love how to write and yeah i really enjoy writing but cleaning wise going to kakuno kakuno is a winner all right i washed fountain pen and dry couple times I change the water and after that I rinse and I put in paper towel then stick in here then making dry let's check No greater. I don't see any greater. And yeah, the ink is completely gone. Here. <laughs> I can't use it. this anymore. It's a lot different. Can you see? A lot different. So if you use using greater or some shiny stuff, I recommend Pilot. Okay, let's put back together as a feed. It have a stopper here. Oops. Like so, it have a stopper here. So easy to fit and not moving. So very, very easy to put back together here. Here is nib size. Here is the pen body side. Just put back. That's it. And let me see. Uh, I don't see any shiny stuff. And here, it have a balls, little small tiny balls. This thing help him a lot. The um, okay example. Greater, it have shiny stuff in here. Yeah has to move before you write in pen you writing something but this ball mixing so it's very fast mixing and easy I really like it and put back That's 
it. All right, that's it. Very, very clean fountain pen. You can put another grater <laughs> or it's just um, something you like. So if you want to use for the something greater, shiny stuff, I highly recommend this Kakuno. Kakuno plus medium size. I think fine is too fine. Sometimes Kakuno medium, sometimes it's stuck a little bit. So, but yeah. Anyways, Pilot Kakuno, that's I using for the glitter inks. Um, preppy, hard to wash the glitter, so I now recommend. Right, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. See you.